Hello everyone in the multiverse and beyond. This is your friend forever, Evan LeFavor, with a brand new video. Yes, today we are going to be talking about this guy, the new Trick or Treat Studios good guys doll, y'all. Ooh, we look at my Chucky. Isn't he perfect? Doesn't he look screen accurate? 100% screen accurate. Look at that hair, y'all. Look at the hair. The hair is perfect on my Trick or Treat Studios. Good guys, doll, look at it. And guess what, y'all? I am here to set the rumor to rest. Everybody's saying, oh, some good guys have long hair and some good guys have short hair. Well, I'm here to tell you right now, every Trick or Treat Studios good guys doll has the same length of hair and the same haircut y'all it's just that you have to style the hair you have to work on it to style the hair in order to get your good guys doll to look a hundred percent screen accurate like mine right now if you go back and watch my unboxing video and my first impressions of this doll you will see that I was initially upset with the hair because I thought the hair was not screen accurate and I thought I would even have to cut the hair of this doll in order to get it to look like it did in Child's Play 1 but no no y'all ah oh, thank god I was wrong all I had to do was style his hair correctly so I thought you know what I need to do I need to make a video for all the Chucky fans out there in the multiverse and beyond who bought Trick or Treat Studios Good Guy Dolls so that I can give you a step-by-step -step tutorial for how to style your Good Guys Dolls hair to be 100% screen accurate, y'all. Look at him. Look at that hair. He's perfect. He's perfect, isn't he? So what I'm going to do now is I am going to mess up his hair to show you how it's not supposed to look so that you know how to get your good guy to look screen accurate like mine does. Okay? So look at him. He's completely screen accurate. The hair is perfect. The first thing you need to do is remember that in the movie, Chucky's face is always open, all right? His hair is not supposed to be over his eyes. His hair is not supposed to be coming down his forehead at all. And unfortunately, when these dolls ship, that is how his hair is. So let me show you how it's not supposed to be. This is how a lot of people have their Chucky doll right now. This is not screen accurate anymore. Look at how shitty my doll looks all of a sudden. Now my doll looks like shit because it's no longer screen accurate, okay? So, but look, fear not. If your doll looks like this, if you've got emo good guy right now, fucking emo, emo good guy, and you want screen accurate, good guy? This is what you do. Don't cut your doll's hair, y'all. I'm going to give you the steps. Okay, the first step you need to realize is that Chucky's hair comes in two pieces. There are his bangs, right here, his bangs. And then there are the back part of his hair. Okay? So the first thing you're going to want to do is... You're going to want to take this bang here. You see how it comes down like this? You want to lift it up and fan it out. Fan this out back. Fan it out like this. See how I'm spreading this hair? And fan it out back like this. Okay? And look what comes, at, comes down in front is his little thing like the screen accurate. 
Now what you want to do is take the rest of his hair, the back part, and put it, tuck it behind his ear like this. Okay? And then you can take this little thing and go like this. Okay? And then you do that with this side. You fan it out. You fan. You spread the hair. And you tuck it back. And then you tuck the hair behind the ears like this. And then you grab the back and pull it forward like this. Like this. Boom, boom, boom. Now, you also want to fluff out the side. Fluff out the side. Fluff out the side. Fluff out the side. Okay? But make sure... Here we go. Boom. So what you want to do is you want to make sure that these long bangs are fanned out to the side. You don't want them hanging down in front. You want them adding volume to the side of your good guy's head. Okay? That's what they're there for. They're not to hang down in front. They're there to add volume. Okay? Now look! Boom! Boom! My good guy's doll is screen accurate again! I did it! Look how much better my good guy's doll looks now. It looks right out of Child's Play 1, y'all. And I just styled his hair. And now I taught you how to style his hair, too. You can do exactly like I just did. Look it! He looks like I just pulled him right out of Child's Play 1! You don't have to cut this doll's hair. Do not touch a hair on his head with scissors. Just do exactly what I taught you to do right there, and you will have a 100% screen accurate good guys doll. Look at them. Oh my God, this is beautiful, y'all. So make sure to share this video with everyone you know who has a good guys Trick or Treat Studios Chucky doll that wants their good guy doll to look screen accurate like mine does. Please just follow the steps. Like I said, it's all about getting his bangs to go backwards, okay? And you've got to fan it out. Because he's got big bangs on this side, and you really do have to lift the whole bang up and spread the hair and comb it back and comb it back, okay? And boom, look it! Look it! This is the good guy's doll. This is the motherfucking good guy's doll, y'all. Unbelievable. Unfucking real, man. Look at him. So, look. I don't want to hear anything more about, oh, some Trick or Treat Studios dolls have too long a hair and some have too short a hair. They all have the same hair length, y'all. You just need to know how to style it right. Look at what I just did to my good guy, y'all. Look at how perfect it looks now. It looks perfect. I'll prove it to you. I'll fuck it up again. Look. Look at it. Okay. This is how a lot of people's good guys looks right now. Emo Chucky. Look at Emo Chucky. Doesn't look screen accurate at all. At all. And here's what we're going to do. We're going to take this bang right here. And we're gonna fan it out like this. See how I'm spreading it? And then we fan it out back. Fan it out backwards. Fan it out backwards. So that there's just one little strand right here. That's all you want. Fan it out backwards. And then tuck, tuck the rest of the hair behind the ear, behind the ear. Tuck the hair behind the ear on this side behind the ear pull the bangs back they've got to be pulled back okay and voila y'all it's not rocket science all you got to do is do a little bit of work and you've got yourself 
A screen accurate good guys doll, y'all. 100% screen accurate from Trick or Treat Studios. Look at how quickly I can do this, y'all. 110% screen accurate. Boom. 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 Look at this. Look at this. Oh, yes. Yes. And like I said, you got to fluff it up on the sides like this. You got to add volume on the sides because remember, Chucky's hair came out like that in the first one. So add some volume. And boom, look, he's screen accurate again. No more emo, Chucky. And I didn't need to give him a haircut. All you got to do is style your doll, dude. Style the good guy. Look at, say hi, Chucky. Yeah, hey, Chucky. <laughs> yes, I'm so happy with this, y'all. Buy yourself a Trick or Treat Studios good guys doll while you have the chance. There's no reason not to. It's worth every penny. This is the most screen accurate good guys doll and Chucky doll ever produced, okay? This blows away any handmade or mass produced Chucky dolls ever. Okay, this is the bomb. You will not find a better Child's Play 1 good guy doll or more screen accurate than this doll here. I promise you. So now you know. Now you know the tips and tricks. Always tuck the hair behind his ear on the side. Always tuck the hair behind his ear on the side. Boom, boom. Yeah. Chucky, you maniac. Doesn't he look great? Doesn't he look great and screen accurate? So cool, so cool. Trick or Treat Studios, you outdid yourself. This doll looks better than any of the prototypes, y'all. Any pictures you have seen of this doll, it looks better than any of them, y'all. This is the real fucking deal, okay? Look at this. Look how amazing that doll is, dude. I feel like I'm on the set of Child's Play 1 right now. Fucking A, this is great. So I hope this will teach you how to get your good guy's doll looking 100% screen accurate. Yes, you can do it. You can do it, right, Chucky? Right, right. Well, with that note, there's only one more thing I gotta say. A day to we Dimbilla. Give me the power I beg of you. Le ver monsieur de bois Shiloh. Sacous in tear me poids de mort. Mortis me le devecour de me voche. Aden le porte boisse Dimbilla. Aden le porte boisse Dimbilla. Adelaide Portable Saint Dembella! Away!